you've now become a producer on the show. What sort of responsibility comes with that? Are you in on the writers' meetings? Do you get to break the stories? Do you have any say in casting or the direction of the show or your characters? Yeah, we were given this um, we were given this credit quite late on in the process, so they'd already broken a lot of the scripts. Um, but we were involved throughout the season more and more, and by the end, yeah, there was definitely a, a lot of collaboration on the scripts, uh, a lot of feedback that we would give the writers. Um, myself and Katrina also were involved in the production meetings, you know, um, just attending them and kind of learning a lot. We just want to learn as much as we can. Um, we would love to have more influence. Uh, and certainly, you know, we're looking to do that next year. So uh, it was a really good start and really nice to, to, to just understand more about the whole process of making the show. So talk to us about becoming producer this year on Outlander. What comes with that responsibility? Are you in the writer's room? Do you have any say as far as story or casting or costumes and set design? Tell us about that that experience for you? Well, so far it's been pretty limited. Um, you know, we got our, our producer credit very late at the at the time. So we, you know, the stories were already broken and scripts were already on their way to being written by the time uh, Sam and I came on board. So it really, I don't know. I mean, we'll see what it is this year. We would like it to be, you know, I would love to be as involved as I possibly can. I want to produce things in the future. I want to learn as much as I can. Um, but really it's up to sort of Matt and Meryl and, and how much they want to uh, engage with us and, and you know I think so far we've always had a really great collaborative um, relationship so hopefully that'll continue. I'm Marlies and I'm Elise and we're Outlandish. Thanks for watching.